How many of you today are, you yourself are either sick in your body or you know someone that needs healing in their body? Would you hold up your hand? Now look around, see the need. And I want you to know that your heavenly father knows those needs. I am presenting the preliminaries this morning. We'll put them at the end. Is that okay? I can't, I can't sit there any longer. Come on. The Lord woke me up early this morning and he started telling me that he hates sickness. He hates sickness sickness. He, did you know that God hates the things that hurt us? He hates the sickness. He hates the disease. He hates the pandemic. He hates the pain. And none of this originated with God. Amen. You know that. You know, for a long time, the church has been lied to by, by the enemy. And we have swallowed this lie that says, you know, God sometimes puts sickness on people, right? Now, how would you feel if your child was sick in a hospital room and someone came into your child and said, your mommy and your daddy, they want you to be sick because you've been a bad little boy or girl. And so God, so daddy, your daddy wants you to be sick because he's got lessons for you to learn. Now, let me ask you, what would you do if somebody did that? to your child in a hospital room. I tell you what I would do, I would get really, really, I could use words. I would say to them, who do you think you are? And what do you think you're doing? And I would take them and I would roughly move them out of the room and say, go back where you came from and don't you dare come back in here again. Don't you think that the way that the enemy has talked about our heavenly father and the way this religious system has, has taught a lot of people that it is not God's will all the time to heal, that God wants you sick sometimes because he wants to teach you lessons. He's got to lay you flat on your back to get you still and quiet so he can talk to you. That is a lie from the pit of hell. It is the enemy who has walked into your room and has lied to you. He has lied to the church and it's time we expose the lie of the enemy. Yeah. 